Ladies and gentlemen, you guys are going to have a treat today. It is Golden showing up early for round one of doubles. We have Roman Wavebird versus Treva in Produce. I am all over the place today. How are you, all of you doing? Uh, so, so far, it seems like we have Green Team in a pretty solid lead. One stock left for Wavebird, and he's fighting from the ropes right now. Uh, just kind of getting comboed. Ooh, nice back air by Treva. Going to take out his partner and another back air to take out the blue team in general. Green Team. Um... Seems like this is a pretty uh, one-sided match so far. I mean, that was about like a, what, five five stocks, I think? They had left four or five stocks, something like that. It was pretty close. They, uh, they, they, they were doing pretty good. Roman, uh, a player I'm not, not familiar with. Uh, Wapered, Produce, and Trevor are all uh, some smashers I'm very familiar with. As, as you should be, chat. You guys should know these players like uh, like nothing by now. I don't need to explain their backstories. Except for Roman, he might have a cool backstory. Maybe he's like anime-esque, you know? He looks like an anime character, kind of. So they're just discussing stage bands, and I guess, I think they're playing Ivysaur uh, Falco? Falco. So yeah, they might, they were on PS2, didn't work out. They banned both the big stages. Which I think is, is, is uh, or at least one big state. Dreamland is not something that they want to take them to. We just have a complete double Ganon switcheroo. Like, this is what's happening right now. A double Ganon switch around. You can't just pull out a double Ganon and, and come to uh, come to WarioWare without having some kind of confidence. Because you really don't have to have any kind of confidence in how you... Uh, you're pretty much double Ganon. Although... That just didn't seem, it's not seeming to work out for them very well. Uh, that was just a really quick stock. Not even 20 seconds have passed yet. And we already have a, a man down for red team. But they're gonna try and bring this back. Ganondorf hits heavy and uh, he hits uh, frequent. So we'll see what happens. If red team can stop killing each other, that would help. So we're gonna see what red team has to do here. Uh, this could be very difficult for them. Seeing as how uh, they do have 
Uh, Trevor, who is playing the Ness character right now, is, Ness is a very good character at comboing, a uh, very good character at getting early kills at back throw. As well as Protus, Protus has a solid neutral for being an Ice Climber player. Um, ice Climbers generally have to have better neutrals than most characters in the game. Um, and he got that grab, and he just got a nice nair, and he got a nice double kill right there. So, nice all around. That's like six nices in a row at this uh, Trevor gets that uh, good down air. Uh, red team just still having a hard time. Produce, though, gonna just make it back with extreme mashing power. Great job by him. Produce kind of dropped their re-grab over there. Didn't really work out too well. Ooh, and Waybird makes that back from the uh, side B. And <laughs> Produce almost by himself is keeping both these Ganondorf players off stage. But there we go. Gets him with the Ganon hug, and that's pretty much about it. Ganondorf, unfortunately, does not have the greatest recovery. And wow, he intercepts him with Nana, but drops her in the process. But that was all right. That was the last stock. And we have a last like, situation for Red Team. Um, Roman is going to have to try really hard to bring this one back. And that forward smash, though, is going to take that in a quick 2-0 by uh, Orton, Produce, and Trevor. So good, uh, good stuff by them. Ha uh, fist bumps all around. Firm handshakes to everybody involved. That was great. Everyone can go home. I am orange today, if you guys didn't know. Uh, we're going to cover that up. We're not sponsored by them. So that's exciting.